Hello to everyone and welcome to another update on the market. For today, I decided to cover British pound versus US dollar. I will speak about the coal market, crude oil and Bitcoin versus US dollar. I will start with um, British pound versus US dollar first. So what we have here, this is the hourly time frame chart. Uh, we can see there is a very strong uh, support zone around 1.2100. This is something that uh, I also spoke about yesterday. So yesterday we also had rejection of that level back into the 1.2190. This morning the similar um, situation is happening. So again around 1.2100 there is a, a aggressive reaction from buyers and there is a bidding happening of this support zone. So there are some scenarios here if market uh, uh, can so we have rallied this if market can pull back and hold on the pullback without underlying heavy supply there is a chance for retest of this a previous swing high and area let's say 1.2175 1.2200 area so if we see maybe some down break um, of 1.209 in hole below and with a weak reaction on the upside then there is a chance for retest of the swing low around 1.2040 mark so so far, we might see also some double top, uh, double bottom formation, pardon, uh, in this area. So might be in the creation, but still we need to see how the supply will react on based on this uh, after this uh, upside reaction of the of the support. Speaking of the gold market, just uh, keep going upside. Uh, it, we never had any down break in this area, uh, so market was just keep going higher with building these contractions and those rising trend lines. But this area is a very critical around uh, 1987 and 1999, or let's say a 2000 mark. Because if we go here, let's say on a two hour time frame, you will see basically here that there is a, lots of swing highs around that area. So this will be a very critical pivot point for today for the goal. Now, two scenarios are here. Um, if market can go upside strong, you know, and break through this, then the next area is 2000 mark. If market can break at 2000 and hold above, then the next area is 2040 uh, mark on the goal. So, but obviously, I would like to see how the supply will react on this area. Will we have over uh, like some stronger reaction from sellers or not? The case for the downside scenario will be if we see like a stronger reaction from supply. And we go near this trend line because if we just go here, and if the market cannot react higher, or we have the break with no follow, with no re big reaction from buyers, and there is a chance for rotation back to 9020 uh, area, and this, you know, maybe even to the 19 uh, to the 1895. But that's just for me, you know, just example. If we have bigger supply, go through this, maybe go like below the 1946, 1947, hold below. And there is a chance for that downside scenario to play. So far, still buyers in control, demand in control with no over having supply, but key resistance on the test. Crude oil, we spoke about this too, so we got a higher lows that we were building in the last couple of days. We took the previous swing high, we're holding a ball, we're making the new high today, and it seems like there is a field for the further higher prices and uh, Let's say most likely scenario markets have a chance to test 92, maybe 93, 50, even 95. But also I would like to see <clears throat> so far where momentum is at upside. So there is a chance for the, um, revisiting the next uh, pivot level, 92. And then we will see around this area what kind of supply we're dealing with. So that's the most likely scenario. Now, in case if we have some kind of scenario, if the market will sell off back into this range, uh, then we might have more consolidation, maybe even then later on breakdown, which if we can hold below, we can see lower prices. But that's just scenario that will will take time and it will take lots of ingredients in order to to develop. So far, demand is in control. And Bitcoin versus US dollar. So we spoke about potential for the market to rebuild higher if we clear this pin bar. That's exactly what happened this morning. Here we can see that Bitcoin cleared this pin bar, uh, this uh, resistance area, and now is trying to clean fully this pin bar high at 30,000 mark. So that 30,000 mark is something that I'm paying attention. In case if we 
So this was a breakout in early in the morning, which is carrying uh, pretty decently here. But here around this pivot, I would like to see what kind of reaction and do we will have bigger reaction from sellers. If market can go higher and hold above, then there is a chance for retest of 31,000 mark. From the other side, if market just break or just test and reject aggressively, you know, then there is a chance for rotation back towards 27,600 or 27,500 mark. That will be all for this update, guys. I hope that you did enjoy and have a nice trading day and speak to you from, um, from next week, from Monday.